When troubleshooting a situation where you have temperature fluctuations or a limited water flow, it is important to follow a few pre-check steps on your mixing valve. First, make sure that the check stops are fully open. To do this, ensure that the screw in the center of the check stop cap is flush with the top of that check stop cap. Next, make sure the hot and cold inlets are properly connected and that there is no cross connection or leaking stop checks occurring in the system. Also ensure that the hot water heater output is at least 15 degrees above the desired set temperature and ensure that the inlet shutoff valves are in the fully open position on both the hot and cold lines feeding the mixing valve. After reviewing the pre-check steps, you can verify that the check stop is working properly by removing it from the valve. First ensure the water supply to the valve has been shut and then remove the check stop with a wrench. With the check stop out, check that the spring is functioning correctly and that the filter screen is clean. Also inspect inside the valve to make sure that there is no debris that can cause clog. Once inspected and everything appears functional, reassemble by placing the filter and the screen back inside the mixing valve and tightening it back down. If parts do need to be replaced, refer to the valve installation manual for repair kits that are available through your Bradley representative.